As we know, the scarlet ibis is one of the national birds of Trinidad and Tobago. It is a vivid scarlet bird with a curved bill. So the scarlet ibis live in large groups and fly in a V formation from their roots to their feeding grounds. The young or the juveniles are brown with a white rump and belly. They feed in shallow waters along the coast, in mud flats and in lagoons. So in order for these scarlet ibis to maintain their red color, they usually have to eat a lot of shrimp. They sleep in large groups in mangrove trees along the coast, together with herons. So these birds are scarlet except for their black wingtips. Their curved slender bills are used to probe into shallow water, mud or grass when foraging for food. Similarly to flamingos, they feed on crustaceans which contain carotene and gives the ibis its brilliant red color. Scarlet ibises are very social. They live breed and travel in flocks and during flight they form a V formation which decreases the resistance caused by the wind for the trailing birds behind them. Once the leader of the flock grows tired it would fall to the back where another bird would take its position at the front. They are generally quiet. They only grunt or croak at breeding grounds and when they need to communicate with each other the birds will make a honking noise and their nestlings have a shill cry used to let parents know that they are hungry. For safety purposes they have been known to associate with other birds such as egrets and herons whilst feeding or flying. Scarlet ibises are serially monogamous. They form pairs that remain faithful within a single breeding season and cohabitant, sharing parental responsibilities for the young. So some fun facts about the scarlet ibis. The ibis is the only shorebird with red coloration in the world. They are very ancient species of birds and they have fossil records going back 60 million years and before scarlet ibis chicks can fly they regularly swim around the nest territory and habitat destruction and poaching have caused the decline in several ibis species they feed in they sleep in large groups in mangrove trees and I forget what they do. They sleep in large groups in the mangrove trees along the coast and they sleep with herons as well.